Three men are training to be Vladimir Putin's bodyguards. The training course is exhausting and incredibly challenging. On their last day of training, the instructor separates the three in and puts them in separate rooms, calling them one by one into the presidential hallway. Sergeant Andreev, come into the hallway. Yes, sir. Andreev marched into the hallway. Sergeant, behind that door is President Putin. He is alone and undefended. On the table is a gun. You are to shoot him and then report back to me. Sergeant Andreev goes into the room and closes the door. Two minutes later, he returns. Sir, my respect and admiration for our leader and protector of Russia is too great and I will not shoot him. Very good, Sergeant. Return to the room and tell no one of what happened here. Bring me Sergeant Brusilov. Yes, sir. Brusilov marched into the hallway. Sergeant, behind that door is President Putin. He is alone and undefended. On the table is a gun. You are to shoot him and then report back to me. Sergeant Brusilov goes into the room and closes the door. Two minutes later, there is the sound of a gun being fired. Pop. Brusilov returns outside. Sir, my respect and admiration for our leader and protector of Russia is too great. I chose instead to shoot myself, but the gun was loaded with blanks. Very good, Sergeant. Return to the room and tell no one of what happened here. Bring me Sergeant Pavlichenko. Yes, sir. Pavlichenko marched into the hallway. Sergeant, behind that door is President Putin. He is alone and undefended. On the table is a gun. You are to shoot him and then report back to me. Sergeant Pavlichenko goes into the room and closes the door. Two minutes later, there is the sound of a gun being fired. Pop. Then six more pop 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 pop. Then there is the sound of glass breaking and wood shattering. Then Pavlichenko returns outside. Sir, the gun was loaded with blanks, so I was forced to beat him to death with a chair. 